right down here. Okay. Right here, sir. We're just struggling to have enough blood drives on our calendar to meet our hospital needs. And a drive like this really helps to make a difference to ensure that there's blood available for hospitals. And we are so appreciative of Central High School and uh, the entire Little Rock School District for supporting us because especially at times like summer, in addition to being the COVID-19 period. He, he set a target, Mario did, of, uh, with Arkansas Blood Institute to say they needed to have about 140 people more or less participate. And if that happened, that was going to be the largest blood drive they've ever had right down here in the downtown region. So um, it's very exciting, especially you couple that with the fact that there's a, a real need. Um, they're about 75% of the amount of blood that they need donated coming in. And so this is impactful. People take for granted that there's going to be blood in the hospital and available on a shelf whenever needed. Unfortunately, that's not always the case. And I, if I was going to give one message to people, just to understand the volatility of the blood supply is really a day in and day out endeavor. And that's why it's important to have donors come out each and every day to help meet those needs. Donating blood is still a very safe and healthy thing to do. Um, we've taken precautions to ensure that we're using the social distancing. Um, all of the guidance has been given by the CDC and the health department. Um, obviously, we're wearing face masks to uh, also aid in that effort. And we're wiping down all of our equipment after every use. All of our, all of our equipment is one-time use only. And so people can be assured that it's safe and it's healthy. And um, we have no concerns about, um, you know, we take the temperature as well just to ensure everybody's safe and healthy. We all know of somebody in our family, probably even just in the last month, that's had some form of uh, need to be in a hospital. Um, my mom had a fall, you know, and, um, you know, she's getting over it, but she had a severe concussion. Uh, others have had family members that have heart attacks or someone that's having a baby or there's all sorts of things where complications can arise where you need uh, this form of support, which is blood. Where people can go now is, since this, uh, this particular setting is just one day, they can go to Markham and Shackelford, and that's the location of the Arkansas Blood Institute. I'm proud of, how I think Little Rock School District is the community, and the community is Little Rock School District, and so this is kind of an extension of that, of us supporting something like this. Great day to give blood. <laughs>